Hi, John Clements here. Welcome to the UMass Video Fruit Advisor. Today is Friday, October 21st, 2011. And I want to tell you a little bit about this Suncrisp apple today. Now, Suncrisp was tested as New Jersey 55. Um, it was bred by Rutgers, who's part of the PRI breeding program. Um, if I remember correctly, Cox Orange Pippin is one of um, uh, Suncrisp's parents. And um, the, the flavor profile and, and, and high eating quality of uh, uniqueness of Cox really shows through. Now, these trees here on Bud 9 rootstock, B9 rootstock, planted in 2002. Um, the Suncrisp apple, as you can see, is a nice yellow apple with, we get, do get a uh, uh, orange, red, pinkish blush on them. Um, it's a green yellow apple, but will turn um, quite yellow as it ripens. They will get a little greasy as they ripen. If thinned properly, Suncrisp can get very large fruit size. It's a very attractive apple. I mean, the trees are really pretty. Um, I will say that Suncrisp has a tendency to, tendency to be biennial bearing, so you have to watch that and make sure it, it's thinned properly. Um, it's a fresh eating apple for sure. Um, it would also make good cider, but um, it, it's 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 grown. I don't want to say rarely, but there aren't any big orchards of it, so it's a, a niche apple. I think Suncrisp um, is as good or better than Honeycrisp. Um, it, it does ripen late, uh, typically a week or two after Columbus Day in Massachusetts. Um, but again, just looking at the fruit, it's a conical fruit shape. It's quite clean in appearance. It really doesn't get any russet. It will get a little greasy if it ripens up and, and will turn a nice yellow. Again, um, a conic fruit shape. Fruit size can be large when thinned properly. Um, a very attractive yellow apple for this late season. And I guess you, you should know that I really like Suncrisp. Sun Crisp, excuse me. I have to give credit to my colleague, Wynn Kogel in New Jersey, because he really likes it too, and it came from New Jersey. Um, but it's a great apple and highly recommended for pick your own or, um, or farmer's markets orchard. So, uh, trying to think, that's about it on Suncrisp. Again, highly recommended. Everybody should be growing a few. Um, I wouldn't plan on storing it too long. I've heard uh, anecdotally that it can get some browning during storage. That, um, uh, relatively easy to grow tree, particularly on dwarf rootstock. So, okay, that's Suncrisp apple. John Clements for the UMass Fruit Advisor. Um, I will be picking these this weekend. We'll be selling them retail. Um, have a good one, and we'll talk to you again sometime soon.